catch something from them. It really is, you know, a very primal, basic reflex. Dr. Madeline Schauberg of the New York Eye and Ear Infirmary says sneezes are triggered by allergies, cold and flu, and for some people, bright light. They are our body's way of clearing irritants and resetting nasal passages, so don't try to suppress them. Recent studies show they travel faster and cover more ground than previously thought. What's really surprising is the speed at which that sneeze is exiting the body. This video was taken with a high-speed camera by researchers at the Massachusetts Institute of Technology. It is not uncommon for an uncovered sneeze to travel 35 miles an hour and 50 feet. Another study looked at sneezing in in airplanes, researchers used mathematical models to chart how the sneeze moves. People next to and behind the sneezer are at greatest risk. When you're sneezing out 40,000 particles, you're shedding a lot of virus everywhere. Dr. Schauberg says never sneeze uncovered into the open air and don't sneeze into your hands. Use the Dracula move. You want to uh, just bury that sneeze in the crook of your elbow. Have a little packet of pocket tissues with you. Thomas P. Farley, also known as Mr. Manners, says be sure to turn away from people when you sneeze and keep it covered. You're sneezing into your own self and not spreading the germs. He also says when someone near you sneezes, don't rush to respond. Many people are multiple repeat sneezers. So make sure they're done with the achu before the bless you. Dave Carlin, CBS yeah. 2 News. Well, despite the persistent urban legend that your heart stops ever so quickly when we sneeze, doctors say that that is not true, but it is true that we can't help but close your eyes when you sneeze. It's